power, power, power. As he makes the walk tonight, no denying what he'll be trying to do to unleash some of the more devastating kicks we have seen in the UFC in years. Just brutally powerful, and oftentimes he'll do major damage just by landing one or two kicks to that lead leg or to the body, thereby changing the complexion of the fight. You talk about guys like Tiago Alves, Jose Aldo Jr. Enter this young man. Scary, scary power on his kicking game. He's an extremely well-rounded mixed martial artist. Fantastic stand-up, great wrestler, and very slick on the ground. He's worked hard to have world-class skills at every aspect of the sport, and there are very few, if any, holes in his game. So here he is, folks, the Korean Superboy, Do Ho Choi. This is as watchable as any fighter on the roster. 2016, he had the consensus fight of the year against Cub Swanson. And prior to that, a devastating knockout of Sam Cecilia that made him $50,000 richer. This is a man who many believe will become the first Korean UFC champion. This is a young man with potential that many believe is championship potential. This guy has some of the best takedown defense we've ever seen inside the octagon. His timing and his utilization of underhooks and sprawl are world class. And now our tail of the tape for this heavyweight fight. So a more than five year gap between these two fighters when it comes to the age, with some differences in height, but big differences in reach. To get us started, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Mario Yamasaki. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. <laughs> martial artist holding a professional record of nine wins, three losses. He stands six feet three inches tall, weighing in at 260 pounds, fighting at a Boca Raton for Mata, Todd And now the three of his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist holding a professional record of 14 wins, two losses. He stands five feet ten inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting at a Gumi South Korea, the Korean Super Bowl, Do Ho All right, I gave instructions to you guys in the locker room. I want you guys to follow my orders at all times, defend yourself at all times. Touch gloves. Good luck. This is a fight that we have been looking forward to for a long time and is about to take place right hey, now. Go, I'm ready? very excited. All right, we are underway now. Good to have you with us as we broadcast live from Scotiabank Arena in Toronto, Ontario. <laughs> and he's looking for that left. He got tagged there. Oh, huge right hand! Oh, he got clipped there. He got hurt. They're going after it quick here. Oh, he might be out. Oh, straight right. Well, Joe, you got to fault the strategy here. I'm not saying he bet on the opponent, but he's moving right into that straight punch and right into his opponent's striking range. He would be wise to get his head off of the center line and stop leaning in. Nice punch by Duffy. That one hurt. How about that chin? Good defense there. Duffy gets caught by that straight punch. His defense has abandoned him tonight. Oh, good left hand. One, two. Down to three minutes now to go in the round. Oh, head 
Ooh, with that uppercut. That lands. <laughs> Hit nice him hard lands. with that hook. to go in a back and forth first round here. And from here, transitions to the Muay Thai clinch. Beautiful trip. He's putting his hands down on the thighs. He's looking to pass. Well, he's staying pretty effective here, fighting off of his back. Nice strike landed there by the bottom by the Korean Super Bowl. Big punch from the bottom. Final minute. Now he's got over under, Joe. Now he's got the Muay Thai plum. 30 seconds now to go in round one. Duffy's attempt there is blocked by the opponent. 15 seconds remain in the round. Choi's head kick looked like that one was blocked. Round two next. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, hey, hey, come on in, come on in. Great finish to that round. Give him some water, give him some water. Listen. Let's take a look at that again. And let's see that from another angle. Thank you very much, Carly Baker. Try to pick up where he left off. His opponent was in big trouble at the end of that round. Landed that left hook. Joe, huge block there. The defense is holding up. Try to establish that jab. Pretty good straight punch for him there, Joe. Big shots being landed on both sides here. Total strikes. Well, he left his head open there, Joe, and he got cracked with that jab. He was almost moving into it. So let's see if he can switch up the footwork here, Joe, and make the requisite adjustments. Troy gets caught with that punch. Trying to establish that jab once again. He is in trouble. Powerful jab. Well, he's landed some excellent shots in this fight tonight, but more often than not, it has been one and done. So the emphasis now moving forward, combinations. Throw your punches. That one appeared to stun him. Oh, he's getting tagged. Oh, nice hammer fist there by the Korean Super Bowl. And busy as he looks to improve position here. Just over two minutes now to go in round two. Oh, and he's able to land a strike there from the bottom. Nicely done by Todd Duffy. Tries a big hook to the head, but misses. Well, he's really starting to land a high number of strikes here in the second round. No denying that he has taken the message from his corner and picked up the pace here in round two. Straight right hand, no good. Duffy's uppercut to the head. That one, though, blocked by the defense. The kick lands. Oh. He's got hurt here. Oh. Cut, but fell short. Oh, blocks the shot. 
Well, yet again, he goes back to the jab and he lands it. And defensively, this fighter is going to have to figure something out. He continues to lean into his opponent's striking range. He's going to have to stick and move and figure out a way to get his head off the center line. Nice. Oh! oh. He got stunned by a huge shot right before the horn, and now a little bit gingerly, he makes his way back to the stool, and he's only got 60 seconds to recover here, so we'll see if his corner, physically, mentally, can keep this fighter in the fight. And here is one more massive punch he lands that really stuns. What a brawl that round was. You can do this now. I want you to go down and put your combination straight down the middle. I need more of that. I want. Brittany Palmer doing her thing as usual. Third round underway. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Oh, tag him. Oh, can he hang on? He's in big, big trouble. Joy gets in the clutch. Good takedown defense. Watch the shot here, Joe. Hook in the clinch there is good by Duffy. Joy. Oh! Big knee! He's hurt! He's got to be careful here. He's in trouble. Man has his chin been tested early. Oh, he got tagged again. He's hurt! Look out for the arm. We got for the arm. All right, he's in full guard here. He's looking for an arm bar. What he needs to do, first of all, pin one of the arms down against the stomach. Then he needs to scoot his hips under. And his arm's free. Wow, very close. He's in full guard. Lands a strike now from the bottom. Nice work there by Choi. Good shot to the body. Perfectly timed sweep. Well, you gotta be working off of your back. He's certainly doing so here. Nice punch. Effective strike there by the Korean Super Bowl. Excellent movement here on the ground. Well, pretty good work off of the bottom here by Todd Duffy. Oh, he's going for his arm now. He's got the arm here. Now he's gonna throw his leg over. That arm looks locked up tight. It's very close here. That was a deep arm bar, but a beautiful escape. In full guard here, lands a good shot from the bottom. All right, 45 seconds now to go in the round. Very nice sweep. He's got a full mount here. Pretty good work with the strikes here off of his back by Duff. Keep it busy here off of his back. Nice offense from the bottom. And that'll do it. 15 no, no, minutes no. in the books. There it is again. And here it is from another angle. Hey, let, hey, that's the way to end the round. You got him hurt. Listen, when you come out, I want you to start. The lovely Brittany Palmer getting the round one assignment. Fight schedule.
will for five five-minute rounds. That last round was absolutely insane. Both guys got rocked. If they continue at that pace, someone's going to sleep in this round. He mixes it up with the kicks. Nice jab. Back and forth we go. Well, some have gotten through, Joe. This shot is blocked. Oh, oh, he's limping. Well, the most significant stat in this fight has been body strikes. And at times in the past, maybe you could say he's been a headhunter. But tonight, he has worked the body to great effect. And those are really starting to take their toll. Couldn't agree with you more. Really threw a lot of power into that uppercut, but missed. Punch is blocked. Head kick lands, Joe. Oh, he missed oh. that kick. Wow. He's got him hurt here. Looked oh. like it did stun him a little bit. This could be it. Well, not much set up behind it. The right hook misses. Well, it's all pace and pressure down the stretch. He is really lighting them up now. Blocks the shot. And just inches away from landing one of those big right hands. Oh, he caught him on the left side. He's got him hurt here. Duffy gets caught with that punch. The left hook hits home. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. And again, Joe, he's showing a vulnerability to that jab, leaning right into his opponent's striking range and leaving his head wide open to absorb damage. Let's see if he can make some adjustments here. Oh, he hurt him again. He hurt him. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. 30 seconds to go. Left punch is good. Well, he's always on the counter attack, but a nice leg kick there by Duff. Four sounds for the end of round four. And there's a nice head kick that lands. And here's another head kick. And here's one more perfectly placed head kick. Incredible nice striking round, nice on round. display Relax. in that round. Take some water and listen. You're killing him. Brittany Palmer doing fine work, as usual. There you go, final round, you ready? You ready? Fifth Let's and go. final round. He blocks the punch. How about that shin? He's in big trouble. And there he swung with a haymaker. Man, I could watch this guy all day. He continues to land a high number of strikes, just as he did in the previous round. And at least to my amateur eyeballs, Joe, he's not showing any signs of slowing down tonight. Clipped him with the jab. Punch coming, it's blocked. Just misses with the jab. Joy gets hit by that kick to the midsection. You gotta do better defensively. Strong defense here as the hook to the head is blocked. Oh! He's trying to stay up. Oh, 
Under three minutes now to go in the fight. Great punch for the win. Yeah, Joe, just the way he drew it up as he gets the knockout victory here tonight, it's hard to land a strike more flush than he did right there, and I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming. So he'll see the replay and probably shake his head, but ultimately this is a huge result and a huge win for that fighter here tonight. Let's take a look at it one more time. Here's the knockdown, vicious strike. Look at this. Boom. Well, what a moment for this fighter here tonight. A massive knockout on the sport's biggest stage. Seminal moment for that fighter tonight. We go inside the octagon where Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki is called to stop in this contest at two minutes, 17 seconds of round number five. We're playing the winner by knockout. The Korean Super Bowl, Do Ho Choi. So the Korean Super Boy, Do Ho Choi, with another highlight for the reel here tonight. A big win for him in this featherweight division. And it's pretty wild to think that this guy is just getting started. Now let's see just how far he can take it. But tonight the celebration is on, undeniably. A huge step in the right direction.